Okay, hello class. This is Lee, Lee Bidibi, Lee Borski, Lee Bumpty. That's the name I'm going by, Lee Manani. Uh, the point is, I'm going to be switching up all your names as I do these web reviews, playing around with them. Um, that way I get the pronunciations all wrong and uh, I don't have to worry about getting them right. This will be a short review of each site giving you my immediate feedback. I won't go into too much depth or detail because I know we're using templates, but uh, I do want you to see what I see and also um, have a chance to see what the other websites look like that the class has produced. Uh, it's been a blast. I hope the last five weeks or so has been worthwhile. And those of you who put the time in uh, learned HTML and CSS uh, at a basic fundamental level which you can then build off of. There's so much that you can do and so much that you can learn and I hope that you have a, a strong foundation for that and also realize that it's actually pretty fun uh, to create sites. Okay, lots of power at your fingertips. I'm gonna start, uh, let's see, let's go in alphabetical. That's sort of random, believe it or not. and. Uh, Bakker, Baker, Badoogie, you're up first. And um, Bake, Dake, Do, we're going to go to your index and your personalized. Drag it into Firefox and see what we got. All right, site number one Baker Photography. Okay, I, uh, I think you've done a really nice job switching out your photos and all of your text. Congratulations. Uh, I like this page. I like that it's personal. It's about photography and design. It's about you. Uh, I will say the original file. Let's take a look at your code. The original file, bring that into brackets, is from the Blue Spark web page which uh, you can see here so I would have loved to have seen more changes made to the site for example the black the background image and the green and blue color layout would have been nice to see some cha more changes in there um, overall nicely done I would also say that this web selection template is a tricky one. It's a little limiting from my experience, my opinion, in the sense that it's so thin. I think it'd be nice to utilize the entire space of a web page whenever possible. Um, and so if we just randomly look at one like, let's say, apple.com, which of course always has a nice website, you can see that their website uses the full scope of the browser window. Okay, anyway, bakalaka, good job, and um, hope to meet you in the future real life. Please say hello. All right, we're moving on. Uh, let's see, be already long. It's your turn. And uh, be already long a lingo. Let's visit your site see what you came up with very nice very nice soft opening let's take a look so this immediately lets me know that this site is about new media and design it's very symmetrical I love how you got your name spread out over the top and now we can simply take a look so we click we see images Drawings, photographs, some fonts, some food. That looks absolutely ridiculously yummy. And um, nice. And you have your experience. An active link. There you go. Extra credit. So this looks nice. It's simple. Got photographs. Enthusiast. A little bit about yourself. A nice contact. Can't wait to hear from you. Uh, well done. Let's take a look at the original site and see how 
you've made changes. I'm guessing this is the original site. No. Let's bring it into code and see what we have. Okay, wow. So you've really made quite a few differences from the original site. You've simplified it. You've given it a lot of color changes. And um, yeah, I think that's that's a job well done. I mean, it doesn't really resemble the original site too much. In fact, you've changed it enough that it feels very fresh and very new in that way. Not sure if that's your image or not, um, or sort of a hangover from the last. Let's take a look. No, it looks like it might be yours. All right, let's keep going. The art along. The art along a doogie. Nice job. Okay, it's your turn. Be bop a back a boo. Let's see what you got here. I'm gonna drag this in. And hello, I'm Becca. It's a cool shot. I want to present to you my friends. Good friends. Becca's good friends. Got some good friends here. Wow, nice. I'd love if these opened up somehow. There you are, graphic designer. This is really nice. Uh, very nice design. It's very simple. You've got some opportunities for social media. And then this is, I think, important to see pictures of you with your friends. Very cool. So um, it looks like you've learned to alter code, change things around, get to your site. Let's take a look at the original template for that and see how you've done Kele. Okay, okay, okay. I'm seeing some similarities here, which is normal. Um, uh, yours has a totally different feel. This is a nice selection and a nice choice of website uh, to change, right? I mean, yours has a different feel. It's utilizing the different aspects of it to your advantage. I want to check something real quick. Does this site, what happens if you click on these? See, nothing happens. So maybe you didn't have that option. I think you could probably figure it out. But these work really well. So anyway, you've changed it and made it your own. And uh, nice job on doing that. Cool site. All right. Woo. Let's keep on going. All right. Caliente. Calisco. Obukli. Your turn. Let's check out your site. Nice. Okay, hiking to the trails. Hiking with confidence. Backpacking. Whoa. Is that an automatic switch? Yes, it is. Choosing where to hike. All of these things. Let's go to details. Discover more. Blogging. Ideas and inspiration. What we do. So I like that you've changed the text so much and it becomes a very personal side about what you do and how you hike. You can discover more. Please open up to pictures. Good. So, wow, big pictures. I wish I could scan through them somehow. I'm not sure if you came across that as an option to go through one by one. but. I like that your pictures of you or friends or people on mountains. That's great. 
Um, okay, let's take a look at the original site. I want to see the sort of changes that you made. Looks like we're using Meteor. Got a live view. So Kind of tricky. I believe these are the same photos. Yeah, my brain doesn't function that well to make the matches, but I believe they're the same, right? So it would have been nice to put your own images in there. I'm not sure if it was technically something that you couldn't figure out how to do or you thought those pictures were perfect, but I do think that um, it's important that you have your own images in there. But that being said, I think the rest has been changed uh, slightly. I mean, I guess I'd like to see a little bit more of your own changes. You can even see in the background here the windmills. That background image is the same. Um, but I, I can tell that you've got a sense of how all of this works. And that's nice. That's a nice feature. I think you chose the perfect site for what you're doing. I would have liked to have seen a little bit more change in how you went about it. Even this background color is the same and that with the little thing. So um, nice job. You took it there, but not quite far enough. But I do like the site that you created and the template that you chose and the subject of your hike, I mean of your site, which doesn't really play into the evaluation of this. You could do a site about anything, but just saying. It's nice to get out. It makes me want to hike. Okay. Nice, nice work. Uh, good job. I'm going to do one more and then I'm going to take a little break. And uh, Doobie Dobby Denias and Deucin, it's your turn. So Doobie Dye Denias and Deucin. Here we go. Index. Coheed and Cambria, one of my favorite bands. Oh yeah, this is a cool site. Um, I like that you dedicated an entire site to this rock band. It's got their albums. Nice text. It's very straightforward about why you created the site. Uh, members. Band members. Look at that. Those glasses are sweet. This guy is like, take the picture. I got things to do. But you got a sweet, um, you know, pretty cool sight here. This guy's rocking. This guy needs to pay attention. History. History looks good. Got personal timelines. It's a pretty straightforward sight. Um, it's not extremely dynamic. It's very informational. But the images and stuff tend to be a little bit small with this site. You can't really click on them and open them up. And rock is a lot about spectacle. So it would have been nice to see some images that opened up a little larger. And these albums link perhaps to Spotify or something. Um, that would have been the next level. That being said, let's take a look at what you got here. So bring that into brackets. Grab your template. And let's see how different it is. So... Okay, quite different, um, different image at least. Okay, these, looks like these go to different pages. So it looks like these had the opportunity to link to a new page, maybe for each album or to an external web page, which would have been nice. Um, let's see what else we got here. So catalogs, awards, I think my computer might have froze, wow these don't really do much, there's our team, and maybe your team is your history, yeah there it is, so I think you did a nice job, um, 
could have changed the font colors. This blue, I think it would have been nice in the CSS to change that blue to maybe this red or this yeah, like somehow find a, a color that goes along with the theme of the rock band a little bit more instead of uh, using what was already there. But um, the content and the design of the site and the hacking of the tool plate, I think you did a pretty good job. Okay, I'm taking a break. Um, I'll be back with y'all in the next set of videos and we'll be working with uh, Dilly the Daddy Spaldi up next. Alright gang, 